Hello everyone, it's Penny and I. We are listening to music, I'm organizing, and I just got married a couple of years ago and I have a million and one things and I've been trying to get through boxes and whatever. So anyways, I want to talk about Christmas time when you're estranged and what to do if you're used to buying gifts and for your children, grandchildren, etc. And that's not happening anymore because you have no contact or you've been told, do not contact me, we don't want anything from you or you've had gifts returned, etc. I, I, I say, look, look at the world around you. There's got to be a neighbor, um, a, a family in need, St. Jude's, Homeless Veteran Services. There's a lot of places you can throw your money <laughs> into. <laughs> Even if it's $10, you can buy a series of gift cards from Starbucks or Walmart or something and hand them out. Take that money and put it into an account for a rainy day. Do something nice for yourself. And you know, if you normally give a lot of money to your children and grandchildren, go on a trip. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with taking that money and spending it on you. It's, it really is. We think we're selfish when we think of ourselves first. But if you have no one to give the money to or you have been not treated kindly, I... I Throw it out, you know, just just give the money to a worthy cause or someone that will say thank you. Um, it's, you know, a lot of these places, if you donate the money to different organizations, it's a tax write-off. So I'm not saying that's why we should give money to places, but it's just a thought. I, I My daughter's cut ties 13 years ago, and I, after that I did try to mail things out for my youngest and her children, and they were all returned. After that, I didn't reach out, and my oldest did come back for a couple of years, and of course I would do things for her for Christmas, but when she left again, that was it. I no longer gave them money or sent them cards or anything like that. I just, I, I spent the money on myself and people I love and people that are in my life, and and that's it. And sometimes I would take the money and give it to someone at the grocery store that I uh, have befriended or whatever. Just <laughs> do something nice for someone else, so... It's just a thought. Do what you want, but hope this helps. I'll talk with you later.